What does the front end of a Tesla look like with no clear bra after X amount of driving? Because a lot of people always ask like, what does the front end look like if I don't have clear bra? Do I need to have clear bra on every panel or can I get away with just the bumper, right? So we have a black Model X here and it has 60,000 miles. So it's been used. Not every car is gonna look like this, but I just wanna show you that rocks definitely hit more than just the bumper. So we'll start with the bumper here first. There's a lot of like these gray specks everywhere. Some of it is dust, but like you have scuffs here. That probably just happened from daily mishap. You have a lot of like these dead bug debris that's just kind of like a splatter, especially around like this flat area here. Even when you wash a lot of this off, you're still gonna have like like these bug stains that have just etched into the paint. As we go up to the hood, you guys can see there's a lot more damage here. Like these white dots everywhere, these are major, major rock chips. So these are definitely not gonna wash out. They're, they're there permanently unless you repaint or you do a touch up, but then you have these little touch of specs everywhere, which doesn't necessarily look great. A lot of people think, well, maybe I should do the bumper and do like a partial hood, right? Which is like from here-ish coverage and then down. So you could do that, obviously you'll protect from having all this, but let's move up beyond that line that would be there with the partial. And as you can see, there's a lot of things that are getting hit, like rock chips, of course. They hit all the way to the, literally the edge of the hood. So is that a rock chip? That's a rock chip right there, right on the edge. That's insane. So rocks can go all the way up. It's not uncommon. Let's go to the fender here. Rock chips here, and then you have like, you know, scratches and things like that. You have rock chips on mirrors right there. And right there so it definitely gets hit and that's because these are obviously forward facing when you're driving so that's why we recommend doing a full front end which is the full front bumper the full hood the two front fenders and the mirrors because those get hit oh there's a rock right there too some people might even add the a pillars right because they're sort of forward facing and as you can see they also can take some some damage as well